You know that pop I was drinking in that other video the other day? Yeah, that got me nowhere because I totally forgot that when I drink pop, my skin gets the most worst acne. So I broke out in like seven or eight pimples literally and it was all clear. So now I'm back, not really back to square one, but I'm actually in the process of getting it fully gone. So I'm definitely gonna be making a skincare routine as soon as it all clears up. So I can tell you guys how I got it cleared up. So if you wanna see that video, then go ahead and like this and I'll get to recording it soon. Today's video is gonna be all about self-respect. Now, self-respect means a lot to me because I know that I have self-respect, so I feel like it's very mandatory for females especially to have self-respect because honestly, if you don't have self-respect, nobody is going to respect you since you don't even respect yourself. Now, what is self-respect? Self-respect is basically the way you treat yourself. So, do you treat yourself in a good way that makes you feel good and positive about yourself, proud of yourself, you know? Or do you treat yourself in a bad way that makes you disappointed in yourself and you feel bad about yourself and you just don't feel too good on the inside? So, how do you treat yourself? And as we all know, we are our biggest critic, our biggest bully. We literally bully our own self sometimes. We even bring our own self down sometimes. So make sure that when you're looking in the mirror, don't bash yourself. You want to be able to talk to yourself kindly and with respect. So like I said, make sure that you're not, you know, bashing yourself so much. Because as soon as you start thinking good thoughts instead of these bad thoughts, you're going to have more self-respect for yourself. Because honestly, when you are secure in yourself, you will have self-respect. And like I said earlier, who is going to respect you if you don't even respect your own self? And that's literally so much facts because I've seen so many girls that don't respect their own selves. So these males do not respect them because they don't treat themselves like they should be. They don't respect themselves. They let every dude go around and talk to them any type of way. They let any dude touch up on them, feel up on them, do whatever they want because they do not have respect for themselves. And they obviously feel some type of way about themselves. So please have self-respect. Don't be out here just... Just out here like that. Just don't be out here like that. Be a lady, be classy, and stay in the house. Take care of your business, do what you gotta do. But don't be out here, you know, partying, being gross and nasty, and having that on your name. That's not, that's not cute. You need to have boundaries with everyone. And when I say everyone, I mean everyone. Personally, since I am a minor, I like to set my boundaries in the beginning of the school year when I go, like, to a new school because I've been at, like, pretty decent amount of schools. But every single time I go to a school, you set your boundaries. Wherever you go, you set your boundaries for the people that are surrounding you. Because when you set boundaries, you are teaching those people how to treat you. And you want to be treated well and with respect. So you want to make sure that you're setting your boundaries so you need to let every single person know how to treat you. So don't be running around letting every boy um, call you out your name. Don't be letting every boy call you pretty and just sit up and flirt with them. Don't be letting every boy touch up on you. Don't be letting every boy hit up, hit you up and text you and, make, and he'll actually get a text back. Don't let every boy know that. No boy should know that he could even pull you, honestly. And this video, honestly, is not even about, you know boyfriend or girlfriend type stuff but honestly I feel like self-respect right now I want to get out that females are not having too much self-respect because they're letting their bodies go like it's nothing there's a song called SEX by Life Jennings and I'm not sure who the other person was but that song is such 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 a good song for any girls out there that um you know don't have too much self-respect and they're thinking about you know giving up their innocence don't do that. You want to listen to that song and think about how these boys really try to trick into your mind to make it feel to make you feel like it's not a big of a deal. It's not a big of a deal. Your body is a big of a deal. You want to be able to save your body for your husband when you get older because you want to be able to know that only one man has had you. If you, if that makes any sense. Honestly, it's not cute to have your name out there like that. And once you have your name out there like that, you can't get it back. So please just think about stuff before you do it because this, it could be a life-changing thing that you do because you don't have self-respect. So you need to gain self-respect and treat yourself with respect and set boundaries. It is a big, big deal because I was taught this growing up because my mama didn't raise no hoe. My mama don't do that. My mama would never raise a hoe. She just don't do that. So this is how I came out and it's the truth. I was raised by a real woman, so I know what the truth is, and I'm just letting you guys know. I see a lot of 
little girls, like young, 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 young girls that don't have respect for themselves and they're just, they feel like they need a boyfriend to be cool or to be themselves. They feel like they need to be that way to be, you know, to fit in with everybody else, but you don't. You just need to respect yourself, say to yourself, because at the end of the day, those people are not going to get you anywhere. Being cool is not going to get you anywhere. Being nasty is not going to get you None of that is going to get you anywhere. Also, if you have respect for yourself, you will get rid of all of the toxic people in your life. So let's say you have a boyfriend, an aunt, an uncle, a cousin that's just treating you horribly, calls you out your name 24-7, bashes you, make you feel bad about yourself, brings you down, tears you down every single day. It's out of pocket. So if you have self-respect and you love yourself enough, you will get rid of that person because that person is not good for you. Since you respect yourself, it's time to let that person go, for real. And also, if you have self-respect, you will not chase toxic people. So if a toxic person wants to leave your life and they keep telling you, they keep giving you messages and signals and all this other stuff, they keep giving you little signs that they don't really want to be in your life anymore, you need to let them go. Because they've already told you that they don't even want you in their life. So have respect for yourself and don't even chase them. Be like, you know what? You know what? Since you don't want to be in my life, guess what I'm going to do? <laughs> I'm going to leave anyway because guess what? That's what, that, 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 ain't that what you want me to do? Because you're going to end up coming back anyway. Everybody knows. Everybody knows how that goes. But that person going to end up wanting to come back anyway. I'm just going to let you know. I'm just going to let you know. Oh, you want to be fake? I don't need no fake this in my life. That's okay. Back up. That's all you gotta do. Because I know when I get a bad vibe from somebody or they give me some signs that they don't want me in their life, guess what? Azusis! Yeah. So, that is it for today's video, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please make sure to smash that like button! I don't even do that, so why don't I do that? I'm just gonna do it anyway. If you like this video, go ahead and smash that like button, hit the subscribe button, and comment. You know, you know, you know. And have a blessed day. Bye, guys.